All right, so I just sold a black custom PSP. Black custom PSP lanyard. There it is. If you guys are interested, I'll have a link in the description down below to my online store where you can buy these for $10 plus $3.99 shipping. Pretty cool. So here is my scale I got years ago at Walmart. So yeah, this will be one ounce. We're gonna ship this first class. Awesome. Put the label on here and drop it off at the post office. Awesome, my printer is working. And this does have an ethernet port on the back so I can connect it uh, via internet. And this thing is kind of ugly. It's really old school printer, but it works great because it prints the labels out perfectly. And it fits on here, four by six labels. So I'm hoping to get this printer over in the closet where I have my other printer. For some reason, the printer will uh, print a second sheet, which is not good. That's a waste of paper, and we don't want that, so I'm going to fix that right now. Sweet, I got it to work. And what I did was I changed the page setup to user-defined by default. And it is a little bit off, unfortunately. I'll show you here. So we're missing like a few inches on the right side. I'm going to have to fix that too. So here are my printing preferences. Size 4 by 6.5. Maybe that's the problem. And I have the darkness all the way up to 15, so it prints perfectly. Speed 3.25, number of copies 1. So I'll just keep looking here and see what I can do to adjust this. I have this position adjustment under, let's see, advanced setup. And it's at 0.12 inch. So I'm going to change that to 0 and hit apply. All right, so it was a little bit more complicated than I thought. And I remember I did set this guy up for a Mac computer. So all the settings and everything was messed up. I had to reset it and I wasted a lot of paper, unfortunately. But it looks like it's working finally. I can cut it where it should be cut. And the problem was it kept cutting like where this line was at. So that was uh, no good. So now we should be able to print this label out and get my other orders out the door here and get some lunch. All right, so now it's printing a second sheet and I'm wasting more paper now. But it does print the way it should. There's my PO box if you guys wanna send me something. <laughs> but uh, yeah, looks good. Yeah, unfortunately I'm still having issues with my printer, but I'm just gonna go ahead and accept that because I have to run to the post office and drop these packages off. And Richard purchased two lanyards. Thank you, Richard. We have a white lanyard going out along with a, oh, some of these are missing like those tips. Huh, I'm gonna have to take a look at that. Um, let's see, ordered a black one and a white one. And I still have a bunch of them, so make sure to place an order before they sell out. I'll probably order more if I do sell out. Uh, these are pretty cool and I love using them. Let's see how much this weighs. It's a little less than an ounce, so we're gonna go with two ounces to be safe. So I do charge a total of $3.99 for shipping, and this is the cost for the label and this includes the tracking number. And then considering the amount that this uh, envelope costs, around 15, 20 cents, and then another 15, 10 cents for the um, paper that comes out, the, the label from the roll. And the label came out beautiful, perfect, the way it should look, very nice. And at the bottom we have the track all your orders with the shop app, Shopify. Awesome, got my three orders ready to go from the Shopify store. I also have my eBay Funko Pop, gonna be going out here. Very nice. 
All right, off to post office. Let's go, let's go. And I'm using my backpack to hold the packages. So we're gonna go and do this thing. And another vlog I'd like to do is go to thrift stores, thrift store hunting to flip items on eBay. It's pretty damn cold out here. It's about uh, zero degrees. And with the wind chill, it's like negative 17. They had to clean the uh, parking lot. And I had to park my car all the way out. And I totally forgot I was like two hours later. Could have got my car towed. Whoa. This thing's been acting like that a little bit. It's so cold out. I did show my lanyards on my last stream and a lot of people liked the style and the way they uh, were. There was the black one and the, and the white one. And uh, by style, I mean the uh, the clip, the, the lanyard part, the loop part, forgot what it's called. And the thickness of the lanyard itself is pretty cool. It, it just, it really speaks out. Uh, not like the old school PSP lanyard, which is like very thin. So th that's um, what my idea was to have a, a more robust lanyard for your consoles. I do also have the PSP uh, custom micro SD card that you can also pick up and they'll be the same price with the same shipping costs. I appreciate everyone stopping from the last stream and checking out my products online. I had a lot of visitors on the store and I just relaunched my store because I was paying $29 a month and I wasn't getting any sales so I turned that off for about 3-4 months and now I really want to start kicking up the sales and, and purchasing more things and just having some fun with uh, merch from the channel and just doing my thing there trying to build a small business from the ground up but thank you guys thanks for everyone who purchased one and hopefully we'll have some more products in the future luckily the post office isn't too far away from my apartment it's about two to three minutes away but the problem is that this post office has really bad ratings on Google because of the customer service and the guy that works there he's um, he's a douche <laughs> sorry to say that but that's what people are saying my experience with him you know basically you just go in there you do what you need to do and get out that's all that's all he cares about he's not trying to be your friend right just be like hey I need a postage for this let me get that and let me get out of here he's like okay here you go boom 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 done but i think a lot of people are like hey how's it going how's your day going or whatever trying to do small talk here in minnesota we have the minnesota nice people are just so nice around here i don't really have a tripod or, or a stand for my phone so i'm just holding it with one hand so far you know for it to be this cold it's it's a beautiful day you know Gotta be thankful for another day here living in this world. All right, finally made it to the post office. Now to drop these guys off. Totally forgot to check my PO box, but I'm ready to go home now and keep working on content and eBay stuff. <laughs> 